Hi guys, today is Monday. Happy Monday. How's the angle? Okay. <sighs> well, you guys are keeping me company today because the boy is not with me. He's at home. He said he wasn't feeling good today, so he's staying home, but that was a lie. So I'm upset at him for lying to me because I know he's feeling fine. He just didn't feel like coming. But anyways, such is life. So last week I spent a good, I don't know, three hours doing our taxes, organizing all our expenses. So I finally have that all done. So I think my first stop is gonna be um, my accountant. I'm gonna drop by there, drop off all my stuff and file taxes early this year. Usually I am not on it, but this year, um, I kind of want to get it out the way, um, you know, before we start house hunting again. So I'm going to go do that first. Well, I went to the accountant, but I'm missing one piece of information, which I have to get from the bank. And I've been on hold with the bank for 18 minutes. I'm at the courier right now. Like I actually drove to the courier and I'm still on hold. I don't want to hang up though because I don't want to wait another 18 minutes so after being on hold for 34 minutes I finally got through I got the info now I'm at chapters um, it was my nephew one of my nephew's birthday on Friday and usually I get him a little toy but I figured maybe I should get him a book you know because kids nowadays I don't know they don't read so I'm gonna go in here and see what they have on sale all right, so let's look around. I haven't been in chapters forever, and I don't even know what like children read now. I think he's around eight or nine or ten, something like that. I don't know. You guys know I'm not really, I don't really do the kid thing, so. Um, I think he's about eight to ten. Maybe they have them numbered. Do they have books by age? I don't know. Aha, they do have books by age, look. Six to eight, three to five back there. Um, I think he's eight to ten. I, I really don't know. Grade three, right? It's about eight years old. I don't know. These ones look kind of juvenile. So I found this. It's a staff pick, apparently, called Roddy Doyle. I can't read backwards. Roddy Doyle, The Rover Adventures. It's three books in one. It's for early readers, level six to eight. I think he's eight, maybe seven, I don't know. So I mean, this should be good, right? Or what about this kind of stuff, you guys? These are more like learning books. I don't know. Ancient civilizations. I used to like reading about stuff like this when I was a kid. But I don't know if kids are the same now. Or prehistoric world, dinosaurs, hundreds of amazing dinosaur facts. This one's cheaper, it's only 10 bucks. I could get them two of these instead of that novel. Yeah, maybe I'll do that. All right, so I went with two books, like sort of learning type books, you know. One is about dinosaurs, dinosaur facts. It says, uncover hundreds of amazing dinosaur facts. And then the other one is um, a pop-up body book. So I thought those were pretty cool. And then I'm just going to make a quick stop at the dollar store, get a gift bag and some candy, you know fill it up and good to go oh, so I feel productive today I've gotten a lot done and I'm gonna stop by my mom's house to drop that off for him and um, one of my older nephews he's in his 20s he thinks he's beginning to see the first signs of thinning hair so he's a little bit paranoid because he's one of those black guys whose hair always has to look perfect lined up and you know waves for days I was gonna get him a bottle of black um, Jamaican black castor oil, but honestly, I've been using it for years and I see no difference with it. So I decided to give him this. 
This is the Herbal Hair Oil by Duchess Gabrielle, and this is the growth formula. I haven't tried it myself yet, but like I said, I think she's a genius, so I'm gonna gift him that, and then I'll have to purchase myself another one. So that's how it turned out. Cute, right? I even found some tissue in the car, so <laughs> it looks like I actually did not put this together last minute. A little birthday balloon, some tissue, there's some candy in there, and a cute little bag. I'm gonna drop this off. Cause it's 11.30 and the club is jumping, jumping. Do you guys remember that jam? Yo, that was my jam when I came out in the club. Cause it's 11.30 and the club is jumping, jumping. Anyways, enough of that. I think that's it guys. I think I am done doing my errands for the day. Um, I finished up at the post office. Right now I'm just leaving the accessory store, the one that I brought you guys to the last time. Picked up some more free gifts for you guys, for your orders. This time I got like some little chandelier earrings, dangly chandelier earrings. And um, that's it, home time. I'm excited because I got my color conscious box in my P.O. box today, so that's exciting. I know you guys really like the first unboxing that I did for you. That's the company that does, uh, it's a monthly subscription box, but all the contents are from black owned businesses. So it's amazing, great idea. So I'm super excited to bring the new box to you guys. I'm not sure what month this one is, but we'll find out together. So I guess now it's time to head home. It is 4.30. So, almost time for dinner I don't know if I should pick something up or bring something for the boy I don't really feel like calling him because he's annoying sometimes hi guys today is Tuesday I just finished recording my color conscious box unboxing February box so I'm really excited um, I'm tr gonna try to get it up by Thursday and I really love that box because it's one of those monthly subscription boxes which I'm kind of over except for this one to be honest because this one features products from all black owned businesses so I thought that's super amazing I just love it but anyways um, I'll have the video up on my main channel but I just want to come and show you guys my look today so my eye look I'm really happy with that's from the Missy Lynn palette I used to create this look and I think it's really soft and pretty my lips this is instant wow which is by nicole webster makeup also a black owned company um the palette is um, by bh cosmetics they're not black owned but it was a collaboration with missy lynn who is black and my earrings are from tonydaily.com black owned that's my phone going off i think that's glenna because i'm meeting up with her today we're on our way to go meet up with Hair by Glenna, and look who's joining me today. We're friends again. When were we enemies? What, did you talk Yesterday, to yes, I told them how what? you lied to me. When did I lie? Yesterday. I didn't lie. Yes, you did. You told me you weren't feeling good and you were feeling just fine. You just didn't want to come with me. Yeah, I had things to do. Turn around and face your shame. Never. <laughs> I don't know <believe> you. <laughs> He's embarrassed because somebody else is in the elevator. Look, look at the camera. this for? Okay. Where? Don't worry about it. Where? If you were friends with me yesterday and didn't decide not to come, then you would know where I went. Parking tickets. Yes. Alright you guys, so here we go. Do you like my top bun? The boy doesn't like it. It's my ninja bun. <laughs> what do you mean I don't like it? I saw you looking at it weird. Well, it's weird. This is my ninja bun and I like it. It's like you're an antenna for something. No, it's like I'm a little anime character. <laughs> Is that racist? You're racist, so it doesn't matter. Let the world know. So be it. So glad I got braids. Wow, it doesn't even look like her anymore. Wow. She's going to like Jamaica or something? She did it herself. The funny thing about the boy is um, because I've always been 
because I've always put my hair in a protective style when I go on vacation, he automatically associates protective style with vacation now. Yeah, we should be like, going on there's a vacation. No, he's like, I don't understand why you have this in your hair. Like, I don't understand. It doesn't make sense in his brain. Yeah, every day it reminds me I need to go to Jamaica or something yeah. like that. So it drives me nuts. So I'm looking on Expedia all the time for vacations I'm never taking. Yeah. Even if it's not me. Like, see how he just mentioned Glenna got braids? Because like, she's going on vacation! She's not! Now I'm going to be with uh, two women with their hair in braids. I'm literally going to go and book a vacation. Okay. While fine. we're talking. <laughs> I don't even care. I'm just going to book it anywhere. You're funny. Do you know what they say? Barbara Rat. Yeah, we'll do the rest of it. I don't know the other words. We are at Johnny Rockets on the corner of Young and Dundas, about to have lunch. Um, hashtag fat life. Hashtag fat life, yeah, because Johnny Rockets is all about 60s diner, so burgers, malt, milkshakes. I'm sorry, I'm covering your face. Glenna is here. She just went to the washroom real quick. I'm gonna try to put, get Glenna to eat meat. She's a vegetarian, but I think if I throw in like a piece of meat in her She's been a vegetarian for 13 years. I'm pretty sure she's not going to fall for it. Come to the mall, so right now, we're... what is the point of the flip up screen oh. to see what you're vlogging, right? Okay, like this, okay, go. So, we decided to come to Eaton Center. Um, I don't know because we were downtown, but so we decided to come to Eaton Center. We were downtown with Glenna, as you guys know. So, now we're at the Eaton Center, just walking around. Really, I'm not looking to buy anything. But... Are we having fun? <laughs> Super fun. It's date night. Yeah, I might, um, I tried on a pair of shoes, which, no, I didn't try on a pair of shoes, sorry. I went to a shoe store, they didn't have my size of these shoes I wanted to try on. But I saw a super cute headband that I might buy. It's actually like a metal headband with bunny ears. I don't know, I was asking the boy if he thought it was too juvenile, like, do I not dress my age? Why am I drawn to these things? I don't know, but I want it, so I'm probably gonna go back and get it. Now for a break. 